All right, so this is part 41. So, let's do this shit. We gotta go to the chairman's office. We gotta go to the motherfucker's office. Wait. I was about to say, did you just If we miss a step, we're finished. You might say it's game over. Are Bad. enemies popping up at a time like this? Did they really have to make this level harder? Bad. Who's they? See, I got I got over with no phone, see? Oh, they're still sitting there. Hey, Coco. Whoa, what? Did you find it? I did, but what should I do? It's laying on the floor. It's looking at me. You don't have to give me the details. If you don't think it'll work. <laughs> if we give up now, we won't be able to get through. Facts. All the people of the town might end up like this. I'll do it. Yeah. I'll do it. Fast. It's done. What's that paper bag? No, wait, never mind. I don't want to know. Yeah. Probably better if you don't. Okay. Let's head back to the retinal scanning place. Yeah. You look pale. Are you okay? Well, actually, never mind. I know you're not. Moving across a steel frame while pushing over mechanical bears? This is getting crazy. Damn it. Moving across a steel frame while pushing over mechanical bears? This is getting crazy. Yeah, it is getting crazy. At least we got out of there. There you go. Now we're back. Okay. I'm taking it out of the bag. Yeah, you do it. Hurry up and do it already. All right. Don't rush me. We don't need it anymore, right? Just, just throw it. No, 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 I, I can't. I'll get divine punishment. Divine punishment? Sensing ghosts? That's enough of your occult stories. Divine punishment is a fiction the living created. The dead have no power. Damn. Yes. What the fuck? Who the fuck said that? I didn't say anything. That's strange. For some reason, I... I was just telling you to stop with that stuff. Yes. Yes. See? I hear it again. Oh shit, a fucking ghost. <laughs> what? What happened? What are you shouting about all of a sudden? The ghost! The ghost of a severed head! I told 
told you. Now's not the time for fooling around. I'm serious. Miss, you're horrible. Throwing my head at me like that. I, I am sorry. I, I was surprised. I, I dropped it on accident. I didn't mean to. Huh? I, I, I'm really sorry. I apologize. Please, don't curse me. Curse you? There's no way I'd do something so lonely. I just want you to listen. Listen? Like, Oh, right now is being possessed. Like, god damn. Kamaru, get a hold of yourself. You are hallucinating. My name is Tokurichi Toa. I was the chairman of Toa Group in the past. To Tokushi Toa? Uh, I know. You're Mr. Haiti's father, right? I see. You know Haiti. Then do you know his little sister, Monica, too? Wait, so Haiji and Monica are related? I didn't know that. Like, goddamn. Monica's last name is Tawa. So that means her full name is Monica Tawa. Oh, sorry, Monica Toa. Sorry about that, Monica Toa. Little sister. Monica? Yeah, this is from school, way of the playthrough series. Then that kid and Mr. Haiji are siblings? Mm, so you do know about Monica. In that case, I can get right to the point. I beg you, no matter what, using any means necessary, stop Monica from going out of control. If you let her do this, the name of Toa will be finished. This is bad. Kamaru's chatting up an illusion. I gotta bring her back to her senses. The ungrateful child. She forgets she is in my debt for taking her in, and revolts against me. Taking her in? That wolf's mother was my mistress. But that bitch abandoned her responsibility and forced Monica on me when she was a baby. Yeah. But isn't a father expected to raise his own child? If her mother wasn't going to raise her, I wouldn't have tolerated the pregnancy at all. So you basically abandoned Monica? That's horrible. Yep. I even let her stay in our home and raised her. I could have easily left her in an orphanage. But that child made me secure her own father. Fuck. Only Monica, kill your own father. She's the one who made my mistake.
the hell is going on here? That fucking song. Fucking hell, bro. Really, you're trying. Who the fuck you think you are, Sonic? That exe. You're fucking hard. Thank you, that's more like <laughs> Gotta go up here. Oh, wait, uh, I totally forgot something. What? What? The chairman's head! We left it! Now he's gonna curse me again! I'm leaving. If you're leaving, then why are you still following me? Huh? Over there! Someone's hanging from the ceiling! Oh, Katoko! We need to destroy those fucking monsters. I hate this fucking mini game already. Hi. Ignore her. There's no way I can do that. You're too trusting. She's that perverted girl who took away your virginity. Oh. What? No, she didn't. A Monokuma kid is somewhere in this room controlling them. Find that kid and bring it, kill him. You heard her. When the beast Monokumas are focused on her, that's your chance. Ah, we got caught! What are you doing? Look, I fucking tried. Okay. 
talking about Monica, right? Yes, yeah, she just said be it on. herself. She doesn't care about Paradise and never has. God damn. She was tricking us with all her talk about succeeding the will of Big Sis Junko. Damn. So, thank God your ass is leaving Monica. She even took it to help Big Sis I lost to you two. I got ambushed by Monokuma kids. I think that was her doing. Masaru and Jotaro probably ended up the same way. So they're still alive. Then. She didn't just betray the warrior's club. She wanted to kill us. Damn. This makes me want to take down Monica even more. Yucca is like, god damn. She didn't believe in friendship or effort or victory. <sighs> like, she was... Manga was just man manipulating the Warriors of Hope all along, basically. All for the sake of Jun Junko and Oshima. The children's paradise we dreamed of, it was never gonna happen from the very beginning. It was never gonna happen from the beginning. Then what's the point of y'all guys killing all of the adults? Now, I get it with your, with your past, Katoko, but... What's the point of of That's building true. a paradise? What is she doing? I'm not sure, but she said something about the successor to Junko and Oshima or something. That's better. She's twisting this whole situation to make a kingdom for herself, not a paradise for all. Oh shit! So Monica only cares about herself and does not care about the Warriors of Hope. Or the paradise. What a fucking bitch, Monica. And as queen of the little kingdom, she probably wants to be the pamphlet successor. Be seriously the worst! She should just choke on a bowl of poo and die! Hey, Toko, what do you think? Well, first off, I still don't think we can trust her. Sending things like I was betrayed. She probably just wants us to go on guard down. Never! Look! I'm completely unarmed! See? H hey, stop! If you still don't trust me, I'll let you in on a little secret. The whereabouts of that big fat liar, Monica. She should be inside the Excalibur. Anchored Excalibur. at the rooftop helicopter port. The Excalibur? It's that big airship thingy you so courageously jumped out of. It's on top of Toa Hill. If you know where she is, why don't you go find her yourself? Well, I was planning to do just that, but that's when I got jumped by these monokumas. The device that controls the monokumas. Is that in this Excalibur thing too? I'm guessing that liar poophead Monica is holding on to it. She's controlling the monokumas. Jeez, her stupid magic, getting all carried away with that controller. You should snatch it from her. Then. And give it to me for safekeeping. Why, wh why not destroy it, though? Safe or something like that. You're just as bad as Monica. And more importantly, where's the hostage from Future Foundation? This is crucial. You mean that blonde guy who looks like he has really pretty nipples? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's him. No doubt about it. Master has to have beautiful nipples. <laughs> the master you're talking about is in the storage room on the top floor of Toa Hills. But the key to that room is in that liar poop head bitch Monica's pocket. All I gotta do is rip that rat down and snag that key. Yeah, and after she's ripped down, there are rats and that starving dog's come here. You don't have to go that far. All we have to do is make her give us the key. Oh, oh, oh. You're so kind, miss. But remember, the device that controls the Monokumas, just leave it to me. You can trust me with it. I'm After not all, sure. I don't hate adults anymore. They're not demons to me, not one bit. Wow. Now that's a that's some pretty good character development, no. honestly.
Good day? Where is she going? She doesn't hate the adults anymore, huh? <laughs> Don't make me laugh. You aren't that good at acting. Maybe we shouldn't have saved someone like her. Right now, we know where we need to But what if the so already the changed? Already. Before there are more victims, we have to stop the kids and adults from fighting. Kamaru, your eyes are scary. Huh? I told you before, Master comes first. But if we can save the city while we're at it... Got it. Got it. Wow. Oh, so there's a door right here. Okay, so we could save. I want to save first. And I'm exhausted right now, y'all guys. So I'll see you guys next time. Mm. Oh my god. The game is almost over. And I'm pretty excited. I'm still excited about this chapter. See you guys next time. Bye.